just like that getting better and better with that transition. We try to get a little button thing that makes it go all crazy. And one day it'll be entirely done by somebody else, right? I'll just have other people and they'll hit the buttons and, you know, they'll cue me of what to do. So welcome everybody to this fine Star Wars Day edition of Tuesday with Todd. And as a bonus, those that are not members are going to get a free preview of Club OSG. Look at that. That's the cool thing about our business is whether you're making shirts or whether you're making hats or you're making tumblers or you're making anything, we can produce stuff of our own. So it's always fun to be able to do stuff like that. So let me know, what are you doing on this fun Star Wars night? Are you got something planned good for dinner? Is it cold or chilly where you're at? Uh, it, here it is. Uh, it was like 62 degrees in the house and I'm like, close the windows. It's cold. Uh, when it's 62 in the wintertime, uh, you know, we turned the heat on, so close the windows. Uh, you know, I guess I could put on long pants and, and a hoodie, but I was working at the press today. I wasn't going to have any of that, so I wasn't doing that. So let's check in. Uh, we'll check in. We'll see where everybody's at. We'll talk about what we got going on. We'll talk about what's upcoming and where we're going to be at with things tonight. So let's see where we're doing with it. Darren, thanks for stopping in. Chuck, what's up, Chuck? How are you? Facebook user. Okay, if you... And that's Facebook user, not FU is something bad. That's FU is in Facebook user. So Facebook and Streamer don't always play along nicely. So what you can do is if you head over to our success.group slash Facebook, give StreamYard permission. So authorized permission to be able to, to for them to use your name and it'll show up there. Now, if that doesn't work, you go there and you authorize. Renee's a great example of, you know, hey, it seems like every every four days she has to go ahead and go in there. Doesn't always take it. So then, in that case, what we recommend you do is you head over to our YouTube channels at fatdadlive.com and liveosg.com. Head over to either one of those, and while you're there, like and subscribe, and guess what? When we go live, you get the little notification. It'll pop up there. We'll see you. You'll be able to come in, and we'll do all that. So if you are coming to Facebook user, FU Facebook user, this is what we've got to do to get around that. All right, we'll get that off of there. We'll get right back into it. Uh, Renee. There she is. Evening from chilly Chicago. Yeah, it is chilly. It's chilly. And, and Richard, you're dealing with rain. Yeah, that's always fun. Kevin, ready for class? Me too. Patches. We're going to talk all about sublimation patches and what we can do with those. So that'll be fun. Eric, thanks for stopping by. Uh, love the shirt. Yeah, this is so this is this is the logo. This is one of them. Uh, we did up like three different ones of it. I'm going for like the 80s retro vibe. And so as I was going through stuff, I'm like, man, yeah, let's look at some of these logos and some of that. So put a couple of different things together. And and I can't uh, I can't wait to see what kind of things we're putting on, because guess what they're going on? They're all going to go on patches tonight. Missy, woo where's your shirt, mister? It'll go live. Listen, we just launched the Club OSG site. In fact, Aaron was just putting the finishing touches on it. Uh, literally, uh, probably 10 minutes ago, he just finished up that. I, I thought I knew what I was doing. I didn't. Uh, so a couple of things didn't go on there. Uh, that being said, if you signed up for the monthly membership for this and you wanted either the quarterly or the yearly, we can fix that for you because now those options are available quarterly and yearly. Uh, the way that you can do that is if you just send us an email over to success at our success uh, let us know, hey, I signed up for the monthly. I'd rather sign up for the quarterly or the yearly. We can get that fixed for you. So that's how we're going to fix that. And Missy, you know, hey, as far as where's your shirt at? You're going to make a shirt, right? Or you're going to make something. We'll see it there. But we do have plan on uh, having a swag store of having all of our fun stuff in there. They're able to. But Missy, you're in the Masters of Success. And, you know, we kind of take care of you guys, you know, the best of our ability. So maybe that logo end up in there. And we can, can't wait to see what you can make with it. Ooh, 58 and mild in lower BC. Well, hey, I, I could I could handle that. Uh, was it DTF? Yes, this was DTF. So super stretchability, yeah, DTF transfer. So these are transfers that, you know, we produce. Uh, in fact, today, I think we did uh, 100, 112 sheets out the door today is what we did. So not too bad of a DTF day. Uh, I've got, <laughs> crossing our fingers, everything is rocking and rolling with that. Uh, but yes, DTF, my new favorite thing, because I love, I mean, look at the color in that. And, you know, there are some gradients. You know, these are all solids here, but there is gradients in the, the, the waves right there from the top to the bottom. There is some gradients in that. Everything else is just kind of color block. There is a gradient from the center here down to the here, so there's a gradient in there. But, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy with how that came out. Re, thanks for stopping by. Matt, howdy to you as well. 
Curtis over in Kansas, a few people go to YouTube. That's right. A few people go to YouTube. Like I said, the way to get over to YouTube is if you can head to either one of our pages over there by going to fatdadlive.com or liveosg.com. Go to either one of those. You'll make it to our YouTube channel and you'll be fine there. All right. What else do we got in here? Herm, good to see you, my friend. And Missy, rubbing it in at Sunny 89. Hey, well, you know. Everything can't be perfect everywhere. So that's 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 Southern California for you, right? That's what we've got to do. And see, Renee says she's given up on Facebook. YouTube remembers who I am. That's right. YouTube always remembers who you are. And there's Jay Ness pulling in here. Hey, congrats to you. I cannot wait to see how the new lab is turning out. Uh, it looks like it's going to be a very awesome space. Super proud of what you've accomplished and so long, so happy we've been along for the ride. And look at this, making a delivery, but listening in the car. Okay, so I will try and be very descriptive as I can, Sandy. I will I will try and be descriptive. I will, I will say sizes, colors, I will do everything. The shirt is an all-made shirt with a DTF transfer of the Club OSG logo on it. It has somewhat of a fade going in and out with a wave in the corner. And hey, you can always check the page to see what those look like. All right, uh, Curtis from Topeka. And YouTube as well. Yep, YouTube's where it's at. Lisa, Lisa, Sunny, Reno. You know, it, it just is what it is. Then we've got, you know, Darren, 68, and, and Topeka. And, you know, 60s aren't bad. I can handle 60s when it's sunny. When it's sunny, 60s are great. When it's cloudy and overcast, it just becomes chilly. It's uh, it's it's just fun like that. Uh, look at that. Herm thrown out. Oh, there's Janessa telling us it's all coming together. And Herm thrown out. Yvonne, that, a good hello to her. I must have missed that. Oh, there it is. Hi, Herm. Hi, Eric. Well, hi, Yvonne. I'm here, too. Good to see you. And Aaron loves the shirt. Where did it go? I saw Aaron pop up here. There he goes. Love the shirt. Yes. We need some updated pics. We do. I cannot wait to see the progress. And look at that. Travis. Travis left. He left Facebook, came to YouTube, and now we are blessed to see Travis. So, all right. Here's what we're going to talk about today. Oh, is when he pops in right there again. Rainy, I was going to say rainy San Diego. What? How about rainy South Dakota? That's what we got there. All right. So tonight we are going to sublimate patches. Uh, and traditionally on a Tuesday with Todd, what we do is we just hear that damn dog. That damn dog. I haven't heard that damn dog all day. And now that damn dog is going to bark. Amazing. That damn dog. Uh, so totally threw me off of my train of thought. Oh, Tuesday with Todd. So typically, if this is your first time here, thanks for joining us. Make sure you like and subscribe. Uh, if you are watching this and you are able to share it to groups and other people, please do. Because the more people we get here, the more things we get to do. And if you didn't know, in our Facebook group, when we get to 5,000 members, guess what we're going to do? We're going to give away a stalls A to Z press. Talk to them today. We're getting everything taken care of there. So that will be a giveaway at our 5,000 members. So make sure, share the love, get people out there. But on Traditional Tuesday with Todd, we just show you how to press some products. We talk about it, and then we move on from there. When we do After Hours, which is now Club OSG, and Club OSG will talk about what that is. Uh, but we're going to press these. Uh, so we'll show all those, and then we will go into the nitty-gritty of it. You know, where would we price these at? What would we do with them? How would you market? What are some ideas for you? Uh, I really love those brainstorming sessions that we've had, so that way we can go ahead and put you know, put our minds together because maybe what I'm thinking, somebody else, you know, is thinking something completely different. So inside that club OSG, that's where, you know, hey, we're going to try and all come together and come up with great ideas for these. Now, if you are a current OSG member uh, in either membership levels there, guess what? You already get club OSG. You're already free with it. So don't worry about it. If you're, if, if you're like, hey, what up? How do I get into that? You already got it. That's just another member perk. What we wanted to do is we wanted to create something for the, those people that, they're like, hey, you know, I was there once where, you know, I didn't have, you know, a, a, pardon me, I did not have a pot to piss in or a window to throw it out of. We all started somewhere, you know, and, and we just took what we could and, and we tried to invest where we could and we didn't know, you know, what options we had, what we could do with things, how how to go about it. So, you know, people asked, hey, is, is there any way, you know, that, that maybe we can get some training, but, you know, at a lesser price point, and that's tough to do. You know, it is because when we value what we do and we value our time, how do we do that? Uh, and so we started looking at some of the things that we offer and some of the things that we do. And we thought, you know, we're already doing these live streams. We're already doing a separate thing here. What if we just created just a, you know, a little snippet of it? So, you know, after some back and forth and how will this work out, uh, you know, it, it, it did. It did kind of work out well where what we can do is create Club OSG. Club OSG. Uh, inside that, we'll do a um, minimum of two 
after hours, Tuesday with Todd after hours, where we'll go in there and we'll talk about products, uh, you know, pricing of them, marketing them. We'll talk about all of that inside there. Uh, you're also going to get Small Business Saturdays. Aaron puts that on Saturdays. Uh, those are both for personal de development, business development, all around package. So you're going to get, you know, some hands-on training, some marketing ideas, some pricing strategies, some business building and self-development all in one for the low, low price of $14.97. And that is just for this month only. Introductory founders member pricing, $14.97 per month, as long as you sign up. And there are options for a six-month package, or excuse me, not a six-month package because we can't do that, a quarterly package. Our options were monthly, quarterly, and yearly. So we created the monthly, the quarterly, and the yearly package. All these prices uh, are introductory offers that are good for June. So here in, or excuse me, for May. So in May, $14.97 a month, boom, that's where you're at with it. In May, we are at $14.97. So when June 1st rolls around, it's going up, going up in price, $19.97. That's where you're at. And then in uh, July, July 1st, it'll go up to its regular price of $24.97. Uh, so you're going to get the minimum of two after hours. You're going to get the small business Saturdays. And to top it off even more, uh, you're going to get your own unique 10% off code to Fat Dad Custom Designs, where you can order transfers from, hey, and you'll get 10% off that, and over at montco.biz, where you can order sublimation transfers for. Now, there has to be a qualifying order, and we'll talk about that, you know, when we're doing the order, but it's off most things. You know, it's not going to be like rush jobs and things like that where it's there, but it's going to be most of the things uh, th that we have to offer. Uh, for me personally, you know, transfers, banners, decals, um, heat transfers, so things like that that you already order, you're going to get 10% off. So think about that. Uh, if you order... $150 worth of stuff of, from me a month now, and there's quite a few of you that do, you could sign up for this and save 10%, and it's like getting free, and there's free training in, in, in there, you know? And, and for us, it's kind of, here's a taste of what OSG has to offer. You know, we're going to have all these training classes that we do. Uh, if you don't know, we do offer a minimum of two training classes a month. Uh, so uh, tomorrow, yeah, because today's Tuesday, so it's Wednesday, we actually have a, oh, something else popped up here. Uh, we have a uh, vanity, it's a tough one for me to remember, and I will, uh, I think I made the link for it, but I, I didn't do, I didn't do good with the link, so I'm going to double check so I don't get the wrong, because we have the guest trainer in for it, and I don't want to screw that up, because, hey, that's not fun, you know, I want to make sure that I, that I have it correct, I want to make sure that here's what we have going on, here's the upcoming one, because it's with Ali Banholzer, if you don't know Allie, uh, amazing person, great entrepreneur. Uh, she's got an amazing story, and her goal is seven figures this year. Uh, so from top, the name of this training tomorrow is from top line vanity numbers to bottom line sanity numbers. That, that, that's a, it's a wordy one for me to remember, so that's why I had to go look. Uh, so Allie's going to help us look at the numbers in our business and understand what is essential to measure and what might be more to, to make us feel good. You know, uh, so it is going to really get into that. I am super excited about this. I love when we have guest presenters on there because it gives us a chance to just kind of soak it all in and learn a lot. And there's going to be a lot of great information tomorrow. So if you're an OSG member, look forward to that. Uh, it's going to be super fun, super exciting. That is tomorrow night, 7 p.m. Central. Now, if you're not an OSG member, you can sign, sign up for that. We have uh, we have the links for those. I can toss that in here for you. You can find out more information about everything that we offer over at OurSuccessGroup.com. Hit it up, check it out, uh, see what you see. You know if we're a right fit for you. But just kind of that fun little taste. Club OSG, Club OSG is going to be just that little taste for you, and you can find you can sign up for Club OSG. Uh, I made the little thing for it. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. At the bottom of the last one. OurSuccessGroup.com slash Club OSG is where you can find out more information on what we're doing. All right. So before we talk about patches, let's talk about what we have upcoming events because there are a couple things that I want to ask you about uh, because, hey, you guys know a lot of information. So I want to see where we can where we can follow with that. Uh, coming up uh, event-wise. So June 15th through the 17th, which it's just like six weeks away, NBM Indianapolis. On the fence about this one, um, I want to go to more see the rap side of things and not the, but the actual rapping of things because uh, it's going to be uh, partnered with RapCon. 
I'm not sure on how it's all going to play out. Uh, you know, I'm, I haven't seen a real big list of what's going to be there. I wouldn't mind going, but I'm not 100% sure if we are. Uh, and reason being is because followed up by that, we've got the DAC shows. And we will be at the DAC shows live in person. We'll be there. We'll be in Kansas City on July 9th and 10th. We'll be in Minnesota at Treasure Island on August 3rd and 4th. That one's in the middle of the week. And then in Chicago on August 27th and 28th. So those are the three shows that we will be at, we'll be presenting at. Now, there's another one that I don't know a whole lot about. And so hopefully some of our members here and some of the people here do and can tell us more about it uh, because applique getaway. Now, I'm not 100% sure where it falls. I thought it was like straight embroidery and this, that, and I'm learning it is not uh, like that. But that is going to be in Irving, Texas. Is that Irving, Irvine, Irving? Irving, right? Let's go with Irving, Michael Irving, Irving, Texas. Uh, that's going to be July 23rd through the 25th. Now, that could be something that we might present at, that we might be there and have a booth, and we're, we're still seeing if we can if we can manage it with what everything is going on. Uh, but I'd love to hear your feedback on on those things on those shows you know are you planning on attending a show uh because me if there's a show that is within five hours uh, you know and you have not been to a trade show before you should totally do it if it's within five hours drive to it go to that trade show and just not to to see the new equipment or to see the new techniques or to learn about products but the biggest thing that you'll take away is meeting new people you're going to meet people in this in the in in the industry so in the industry, you're going to meet people in the industry that, you know, have been where you've been, that have done what you're done. They're, they're going through the same thing. It's it's a great place to, to network with people, to be able to find people to do the things that, that you don't do, uh, to bounce ideas off other people. Some of our best friends are people in the industry that we have met at trade shows. I think half of our wedding party was made up with people from trade shows. I think... Of our core group circle of friends, about 75% of them are people from trade shows. So we, you know, it's when you start meeting those people that you know know what you are talking about and understand, you know, where you're at, where you feel with it. Uh, it is a it's an amazing feeling uh, to be able to have the, the group of people. And hey, you are that group of people to us. I can't wait to meet a lot of you. Uh, and I'm not, gonna, not a lot of you like saying, oh my God, there's some I don't want to meet. I can't wait to meet all of you in person one day. But I know that we can't all do that, you know, depending where shows are. But, you know, three years ago when there was uh, when there was travel and we had no clue what COVID was, you know, in that year we had, uh, you know, hit uh, Corey and Pilar headed out to uh, out to Long Beach. Uh, we had hit India, Milwaukee. We had hit uh, Denver, Indianapolis, Chicago. Uh, we went down to, to Bradenton down there at the TRW warehouse to for some training down there. So we traveled around quite a bit. And one day we'll get back to that. And so we'll make sure that we're going to hit the four corners of the U.S. to be able to see each and every one of you. Because, hey, without you guys, there is no us. And, and I love meeting people. I love hearing their stories. I love seeing where their growth has been, where they've came from, where they're going, what they're doing, what their plans are. It's been nothing but fun. And as... Uh, as Renee has so very eloquently put out here, we talk about ping pong. Now that is a total inside joke. And this is why Janessa is giving us a ha 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 uh, It's a great fun time uh, when you get us to have some drinks. And yes, uh, it did. this did all come about from, um, from the, the, in fact, that was the, the 400th celebration of Two Regular Guys, I do believe, is we did that at Tinley Park. We did that at Buffalo Wild Wings on that Friday night, uh, and a great mixer. Uh, what was really fun is sometimes you don't know who you were talking to. I had a, a great conversation with a gentleman who, you know, I, I had never met him before, didn't know who he was. We, we talked about various things in the industry, uh, and then we talked about, you know, horses, and, and we just talked and then come to find out, you know, uh, hey, he's David Shaw. He owns Ace Transfer. No clue, you know, didn't come off as some pompous a-hole that, you know, owns a company that, you know, that, that looks down on, he was just a regular guy having regular beer, 
I think it was a, a regular beer and some wings, and we were having a great conversation. So there's people from all aspects of the industry, from you know industry leaders, uh, from top tier people to people who had never been to a trade show before and had no clue what to expect it, and were very like, I, I don't know if I fit in. I'm like, everybody fits in. We're all in this together. We all started somewhere. Um, you know, don't don't ever think that you don't belong in this group because the minute you pick up a press, the minute you pick up you know a cutter, the minute you you pick up you I mean the minute you pick up anything to create, you will are a member of this family and we are happy to have you along and help you in this journey so those are upcoming events now that we're 20 minutes into this and i had a comment left on the youtube that said i talk too much and i'm like yo man it's alive what am i supposed to do just do a five minute video of pressing some stuff it doesn't work that way when we do a live now eventually i will get to it where we'll just press things and just go from there and that's all it will be uh, but those won't be lives those will just be you know cut down videos from lives and put out there. So it'll, it'll be fun from there. Uh, and say, Sandy does have a great question. Does the club get to meet on a beach somewhere? Now there has been a discussion of having a uh, OSG meet and greet in Mexico. Uh, I believe we are shooting for 2022, uh, but we will see how that plays out because I'm down for that. Uh, the, we could definitely do, uh, you know, 2022 beach getaway, um, you know, November or not November, you know, like, like in a year from now, we'll, we'll see how it all plays out. But yes, I say we will definitely, definitely do. It. Oh, look at this. Let's move it along. I have a dinner reservation at six 30. Hmm, well, somebody didn't know that Tuesday with Todd is all about me. All about me tomorrow. Cinco de Mayo today, Tuesday with Todd, Star Wars day. You know better than that. All right. So as it was so nicely put by Renee. Let's get the ball rolling and let's talk about what we're doing. Okay, sublimation patches. Now, these patches, uh, I got uh, these off from JDS. Uh, so JDS is one of our suppliers. I love JDS for one for one simple fact of that I get everything next day from them. Uh, so it's really nice that they're, they, they have really good product at really good pricing, good support behind it. Patches are a little iffy right now. I did check before that because you can get sample packs in the various shapes and sizes, because that's the, the great thing is, you know, you don't have to be an embroiderer to make patches. You can just sublimate them and they come with an adhesive back. So that way then it can go on a hat. It can go on a shirt. It can go on a bag. It can go on a suitcase. Uh, it can go wherever you want. We'll talk about applications for them, uh, you know, here after in the, the after show, uh, but they do come in various si sizes, shapes, and styles. Uh, pricing on them is really good. We'll talk about that. Uh, so let's get right into pressing them. We'll show that because, hey, I don't want to, uh, you know, I don't want to keep Renee from getting to her, her dinner reservation at 630. So we'll go, we'll get right over to the camera at the press and we will get to pressing. I'm going to take a sip of water along the way. All right. So let's move this on along up here and let's see what we got here okay camera i had the camera positioned really well and then Corey came in here like a bull in a china shop and moving stuff all around and the camera went all crazy like on us so we got a couple different styles here we got an oval we got a circle we've got a shield we've got a square or a rectangle we've got a square we've got another oval We've got the badge, we've got the shield, and then like a teardrop. So we're going to press a couple of them. We're going to see what we got here. You'll be able to see, see, see. I'm going to start with that badge one because I thought that was kind of cool. I'll show you how to press them. I'll show you what we can do with it. And then we can just kind of move on from there. Okay. So first things first when it comes to sublimation is we want our blowout paper. And that kind of got hooked right there. So we got that. So, put a blow-up paper on here, trim that bad boy down. I'm going to grab my notes just to make sure that I got everything correct here. So, we've got here. Now, we've got for transfer. You can see right here. We're going to place that down. Now, on the patches, you can see that there is a paper side, and then there's the, the print, the, whatchamacallit, the fabric side. This will be the side that you press on. Um, I should have. Maybe I don't. Maybe I do. Um, I thought I did. 
I'm looking for, oh, there it is. If uh, When Corey came in like a bull in a china shop, one of the things that got knocked around, my lint roller. Because you will notice that there is lint on these. So you want to make sure that you that you um, take the lint roller to them. So we're going to do that. We'll take the lint roller to it. We're going to roll, 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 roll your boat. Roll, 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 roll your boat. We're going to do that. Now, we've got a transfer. We're going to place fabric down, face down on it. We're going to line it up right there. And then we're going to use some heat tape. So we're going to use some heat tape to hold this down. And then we'll be able to put our cover sheet on it. And we're going to press it. And then maybe we'll press another one so that way you can see that. So bring our next piece over there. Trim this off. Oopsie daisy. Trim that off. And we are going to be good to go on this. Now, for time, temperature, and pressure. These press at 390 degrees for 60 seconds with medium pressure. What I do is once you have this tape here, you are going to flip that over. So it goes transfer, or excuse me, it goes blow out paper, substrate, transfer. Then we're going to cover it with our cover sheet. And we're going to press this with medium pressure for 390 degrees for 60 seconds. Now, the um, printer that we use, an Epson 7610, uh, that has been converted with over with inks. That was quick. That was really quick. Uh, sh okay. So, um, one thing that you should remember when you're doing this is uh, to make sure that you set your, your temperatures right. Because I'm at 325 for 15 because I just pressed this DTF shirt. So there, my friends, is a lovely screw up. And those are the type of things we do on Tuesday with Todd. Because, hey, um, you know, we've all been there and done that, right? We are pressing from one thing and you go to the next and you don't even think about it. And the next thing you know, you, you press something like this and you're like, oh, crap. So that just means we got to up the temperature and we got to wait a little bit. So we'll come back and we'll talk for, you know, we'll shoot some crap and we'll see because uh, we're at 325 and, and we need to be at uh, not 325. We need to be at uh, 390 degrees. So let's do a little chit chat, shall we? Because, hey, that's always fun and dandy. Yay for me, right? Amazing. Yeah. So patches, like I said. They come in a lot of different shapes and sizes, circles, shields, badges, more shields, teardrops, typical things that you can use these for. And we'll get into a little of the, the after hours pre stuff, you know, things that, you, that I've used these for, name tags. So really good at, at name tags, um, you know, that they're, they're perfect for that, you know, name work shirts, things like that. Perfect, perfect, perfect for that. I'm going to see where we are. Do we have any questions, comments, concerns? Where we're, we're waiting for our temp to come up because, hey, I totally screwed that up on me. Sorry, Renee, you're going to be dinner. Um, you're going to be late for dinner. That, that's that's all I can do. Uh, let me catch up on some comments to see where that we are. Uh, it looked like, uh, yeah, Reggie just wants to be part of that. That damn dog, man. I, totally, that should be, that should, I, I think I saw Missy said it earlier. That should be a patch, that damn dog. Tuesdays with Todd, that damn dog. You like that shirt? That is a nice shirt. Thank you very much, Tina. Uh, it, yeah, there it is. Wendy said it. That damn dog. Is that going to be on a patch? I sh totally should do it. Jesse, thanks for stopping by. And as Renee said, Club OSG equals brain trust. Absolutely. And a very inexpensive brain trust, if I do say so myself. Uh, Corey, let me know that uh, Reggie's just a jerk. Uh, here, dog on the street park and thought he needed to communicate. Yeah, he is kind of an a-hole dog. Total, total a-hole dog. Um, you know, it just, you know. I, yeah, we totally should have listened to Kelly. Uh, Kelly told us not to get a dog, and um, she said just not to get a puppy, and uh, that just happened. Gina, thanks for stopping in and saying hi. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, when did it do? Dak Chicago. Yes, Dak Chicago, where it all began. And like I said, we explained that story from there. We talked ping pong. Um, Martha, woohoo! Glad that you made it here. And let's see what we got through the reservations. We got through that. We got through that. Sandy can watch from home, so I don't have to be as descriptive. George, thanks for stopping by. And Re has right. We have one press for sublimation and one for everything else just for that reason. Yeah. I mean, that's the way to do it. You can have it set up so you have it just for one thing. 
you're glorious. Uh, I'm looking at one, two, two other presses that I should probably set that way. But I just was like, oh, I was done with this. I was curing out transfers. I said, oh, I, let me, I should do up a shirt real quick. So I did a shirt real quick, and then I was happy and excited about the shirt. Man, I, I forgot to take the tempo. I mean, we've all done that, right? I mean, if you haven't, you're lying to me. If you haven't, you, you're straight lying to me. I don't believe you because I know that I'm not the only one that has that. Yeah, sometimes I'll do that, but I'll leave it pressed longer times when I do sublimation when I forget the temp. Yep, and that was that. I If I'm close, I will do that where, you know, it, it's not going to matter as much. But when I'm going from 325 to 400, uh, yeah, I don't want to do that math on it to see how bad and how long. Let's just bring it up because we're sitting at 350 now. So it'll just be a few more minutes. Okay. So back to talking, we can talk about Club OSG. Like I said, you can sign up using the link below here. We'll throw that link up on here. Uh, OurSuccessGroup.com slash Club OSG. You're going to get the two Tuesdays with Todd after hours. We're going to talk about products, marketing, pricing. We'll talk about that information there. You're going to get the Small Business Saturdays with Aaron, which is going to be business and self-development. Great information over there. You know, a lot of times it's the stuff that we don't want to hear, the stuff that we don't think about. You know, it's like, hey, get your ass in gear. Get your shit together. Come on, let's go. You know, things like that, you know, where I can help you produce stuff and show you, hey, I screw up. Everybody screws up. Let's just get through this together. On that side of it, there's a lot of that. That look at yourself. If things aren't going your way, you know, hey, you, you got to kind of change some things. Every success starts with the decision to try. You have to try. You just can't expect things to fall in your lap. You know, it, it's just not going to work that way. So you need to put in some work to make the to make the things happen. So great content over there, and then you'll get ten percent off over at uh, Fat Dad Wholesale and 10% off over at Monco.biz on qualifying orders. And like I said, it's going to be just about everything, but I didn't want a blanket statement 10% off because then I'm going to have somebody that's going to order a rush order and they're going to want it, you know, hey, I, I need it within 24 hours and then I want 10% off of that. And look, let's just be honest, that's a pain, man. And so, uh, no, uh, I'm not. So I said qualifying orders, it's pretty much going to be everything but rush orders. I just want to make sure on some of the stuff that we're fine before we put it there. But any of our DTF transfers, so things like this, any of our, our decals, any of our banners, any of our um, – what else am I doing for you guys? Uh, signs, banners, decals, DTF transfers, printed HTV transfers. Oh, any of, like, the uh, the craft sheets. So if you get the 12 by 12 craft – sheets for us the the pattern stuff that you, you know the crafters are using for um tumblers things like that whether it's the sheet or the roll we're giving that to you 10 percent off uh if you're doing the same thing with the the heat transfer vinyl or the the printed for that uh for the either by the the roll or by um the sheets guess what you're gonna get 10 percent off that so really you spend 150 bucks a month with either aaron or myself for a combination of the two and guess what uh hey that 10% pays for itself. You know, this club OSG will pay for itself in no time at all. You will be set and ready to go. Can we do canopies? Yes, we can do canopies. We can have canopies done for you. So no problem at all. Darren, this just hurts my heart. Uh, Darren is a great example. Darren sent me an order uh, and uh, it was for some white on clear. So I have to do a different process for that. And uh, it was two different orders and we, you know, submit them both. Accepted one order, the other order expired, uh, and I completely dropped the ball on it. I, I did. I dropped the ball, and he sent me an email, and he's like, hey, I'm just checking in on these when these coming in. Okay, so uh, my goal is to have that out tomorrow. I'm crossing fingers that everything is going to go well, that I can have that out, and we're going to overnight for it, and we're taking care of it there, so you will have them here by this weekend. Uh, but, yeah, we, we totally dropped the ball on that, and things like that happen. And, and when things like that happen, you know what you have to do? You just buck up and say, hey, screwed up, man. Sorry. Uh, you know, I, I'm sorry I screwed up. I know it, it's probably screwing you up, too. Uh, but this is the this is what my plan is. This is how we're going to fix it for you, and we're going to take care of it for you. Uh, you know, get on here. Say, hey, hey, live. I screwed up, man. Screw ups happen. We do what we can to not screw up. But things happen, and you just have to own up to it. Don't try and, and pawn it off and say this or that. But, yeah, I totally – I screwed the pooch on it, and I just saw that the one order – um, that, that was passed on, thought the other one was too. I didn't look at it enough. And I go back and look at invoices like, oh, shit. Way to go, Todd. Way to go. So we'll get it taken care of. 
All right. Look at that. We're close to Tim, so we can get back over there. I can take another sip of my water. We can get back over here. We can press some patches. I say, I say, I say. All right, patch time. So, I think we said we've already got this bad boy on here. We're just going to press it. It's going to be 60 seconds. Because that's what really threw me off. Because I know how, roughly how long my spiel is, when uh, what we're using in the paper and all that. So that, that's how I knew I should have checked on that. And I said the printer that we use is a uh, Epson seventy six ten that's been converted over to sublimation. And by converting over, it just means hey, we put different ink in it. The ink came from driven by graphics. You can find uh, those uh, those links in our uh, link tree l-i-n-k-t-r dot e-e slash fat dad cd uh well I'll throw that up on the screen for you here in a few you can find the links to that there is a 10 percent off discount code if you order ink through our link with our code so that's a plus there marvin's a great guy to work with uh, we've always had great luck with him we've worked on projects back and forth so he'll take care of you he'll definitely make sure that uh, you're taken care of on that paper is our a sub paper uh, a some paper from Amazon. So here we go. We got the three, the two, the uno. Let's see how this one came out because, hey, remember, we, we screwed this one up. So it looks like it's going just fine. We're going to pull it off there. Remember, it's going to be hot. It's going to be hot. It's going to be hot. But look at that bad boy. Look at that. Would you look at that? Would you, would you look at that? So ta-da, ta-da. Founding member, Club OSG. How sweet is that? We'll put that on, on something fun. Now, the things with these patches, what you're supposed to do is, like I said, there's the adhesive on the back, and you can see where it's, you know, there's the little paper to peel off. These need to um, basically cure for an hour. Uh, it'll allow the, the adhesive to, what is that word? There's a reconstitute. Is that the word I'm looking for? Somebody will tell me if I'm wrong or not. Uh, but you need to wait for, you know, an hour before you're able to put this on things. But other than that, I mean, you can see pretty, pretty sweet. I mean, the black for the ink, for everything there, blacks look good. The colors all through that. So, you know, matching up. I think that turned out really, really spooktacular. I'm happy with that. Now, uh, let's do another one. Let's do another one. Let's do another one. Let's see what we got. Let's go with one of the... Uh, other fun where's the other ones where's the other one yeah let's see how this one does so we're gonna go on we're gonna go on this one so same thing now we can see where this is so we just don't have to use that same spot uh, remember paper side or not paper side paper side down fabric side up on the transfer hopefully that made sense we're gonna roll 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 our boat we're gonna put this transfer there's that way Here's this way. We're gonna line this up. I prefer the the black edged ones uh, because one, I think it, it it looks better, and two, is it covers any mistakes because hey, there's a black edge right there. So we press it down there. We put our cover sheet back on. We're going to hit this at 390 degrees for 60 seconds with medium pressure. Now, these patches came from JDS. Uh, you can sign up for an account for them if you don't. Uh, they do have sample packs, but the sample packs looked a little out because there, I think there's a couple of the sizes and shapes that are missing or are currently out of stock, so they don't have the samples. That is the one good thing that, or one of the good things, excuse me, that I like about JDS is that they do have a lot of sample packs. So if there's a, you know, a bunch of ornaments and things, look and see, they might have a sample pack that has five or six different ornaments in there for you to choose from. Uh, I know they have that with these patches, there's one things like that. Um, there was like that with some keychains, uh, the, the tumblers, well, when we got our tumblers, that's how we did it there was uh, the sample packs. We brought in one of every color there. They're really good about stocking things like that. So definitely give them a try, uh, check out the JDS, see what they have to offer you and how they can help you out here. So here we go, three, two, one. Let's pop this bad boy back up. We will peel back our protective sheet. We'll pull this off of here and ta-da, ta-da. That is effing hot. You know, I guess I have a glove I could put it on, but you can see, look at that. Club OSG, my friends, woo. So we'll come over, we'll show you this too on this, and then we will get right into what we do 
here on After Hours, and you'll be able to see. I'm going to grab a drink. I'm going to grab the mic. I'm going to join you back over here, and we're going to talk about a couple fun different things. Let me get a drink and turn this camera back on me. Tuda. Okay. So there we go. Club OSG. Look at that. Ooh, look at that fun fade. Everything's through fine dandy through there. Look at that. Founding member. I'm gonna put that right here on this shirt. Yes, yeah, so that way I match and I'm pretty cool like that. Because I'm cool. I can make my own stuff. I can say whatever I want to do. All right, so we'll put it through there. All right. Uh, purchasing Missy was purchasing ink for SG 100 as I watch. It's a sublimation in DTF day over there. Way to go, Missy. Yes, we did say we do canopies. Thanks, George. That looks good. Reed looks good. Thank you. And I'm guessing this was cute or cure. It could be either way. And those are sweet. Thanks, Herm. All right. So typically, this is where we'd say, okay, here's what these are. These are they, these are patches from JDS. You know, we pressed them at 390 degrees for 60 seconds. We used the ink, yada, yada, yada. And we would wish you a happy, happy day, and we'd move on. But, my friends, you guys get to stick around for a little after hours, a little club OSG. I should probably put on some sweet sunglasses, the nose thing to make this all look fun. But uh, I say... We should go ahead and move right along. Oh, George, great question. I got it in my notes. George had a great question. When you order them, oh, there we go. Uh, color looks good when you press them on shirts. What's time and temp? So when you press these on for that second one, uh, you are looking at 300 degrees for 15 seconds if you're using a heat press. Now, if you're selling patches as a standalone and somebody's going to put them on at home, they're going to set it to the uh, 300 degrees, which is the wool setting, the poly setting. They're going to set it to there. Uh, and it's going to be 15 seconds, but from the back side. So if you're going to put it on the shirt, they're going to do it from this side. That's where they're going to iron on from there to activate that. They're going to peel off this little paper back in there and put it on there. Uh, like I said, you got to wait an hour. Uh, you got to let it rest an hour to allow that, uh, that adhesive to reconstitute, I think is what the correct word is that they have in there. But that is what they are. And yes, 92 is a single. If you just buy one, boom, boom, that's what they are, 90, 92 cents a piece. All right. Now I'm going to uh, – here's the thing. So we said free preview. Absolutely. If you are in our Business Basics group or if you are on our OSG Facebook page, if you are in the private members group, if you are on Fat Dad Wholesale YouTube, if you are on Live OSG, you are all – in for the free preview. If you're anywhere but those places, find one of those places now. I think the easiest place to go to is if you just go ahead and hit over to either fatdadlive.com or liveosg.com. Get over to those feeds there where you will get to enjoy the free preview of what OSG has to offer. I will sign off with you guys. You have a few minutes to get us over here, fatdadlive.com or liveosg.com. Go there now. We'll see you pop up there because we're cutting your feed off in three Three, two, wait, I got to do it so I don't give you the finger. So it's three, two, one. We're cutting your feet off. We will see you next time. For everybody else, don't worry. We're not going anywhere. We're going to kick right in to after hours and go from there. All right. So right now, we should be live in all of our places. So we should be live in our Facebook group. We should be live in our private members group. We should be live on our YouTube channels. We should be live, live, live. So let's talk about what we can do and how we can do it, right? Okay, so I'm going to screen share here and we're gonna talk about pricing and we're gonna talk about what we can do on that. Uh, I want to bring up a window and I wanna bring up the OSG, right? Is that one highlighted? Yes. All right, so add to stream, boom. Now I need to find it on my screen screen so I can play with that. All right. So if you have not, if you're not an OSG member, I think I can make that, uh, I can make full screen. Yeah. Yeah. I just got to move the, the thing over here so you can see it. If you're not an OSG member, you will have no clue what this is. Uh, this is the spreadsheet 
for our uh, for our members. So if you're a member, go in there and get it. This is how we do all of our pricing. This is how we know where we need to be at for things. Let me take this banner down here. So that's not the way I do, do see that. That's in the way for you guys. So let's go through and add some stuff to it. So these products, we're just going to call them patches. These are patches, right? Now, our raw cost on them is going to be 92 cents. Now, the price does get cheaper if you order more. Now, miscellaneous cost. We have miscellaneous costs that go with just about everything. You know, it could be from the lint roller. It could be from the tape. It could be from it. So your best cost is, you know, you'll go through a run, see how much something costs you. You'll, you'll see what you have in there, supplies. You'll, you'll see what you have in there. Now, for us with the tape, lint roller, um, you know, the paper, all of that, let's call it, a, you know, when you break it down on how many you can fit on here at a time, and we'll talk about this as we go across the as we go across the, the thing here. Our raw, our miscellaneous cost is about a dime on this. Freight in, same. Uh, we order enough in so it comes in at free. But if you don't, you want to you know break it down. If you only order one thing and you're paying fourteen dollars for shipping, guess what? That needs to count for something. Here, let's just say freight in costs us a quarter. All right. Now, decorated cost. Okay, so what does uh, what does it cost to decorate it? What is, how much is, is a piece of the, um, excuse me, how much is the transfer? So how much is the paper? How much is the ink? You know, so we figure our ink cost is a dollar a sheet and a sheet is a dollar. So there's $2 for if we use an entire sheet. Well, if we can put nine of these on a sheet and you can print way more than nine, I just printed nine out here. Uh, our cost on it is like, is 22, is 22 cents. Okay. So we've got our raw cost, our miscellaneous cost, our freight in, our decorating cost. That's what we've got going on here. As we go across here, you know, we've got other costs. You know, is there other costs that are in here? And if you click on that, you know, is there sewing? Is there weeding? Is there bee sheets? Is there, is there other extra costs that are on it? You know, do you have other labor that's on it? You know, contract help, extra design work, did say, you know, anything that they can go in here goes in this column. Now, packaging cost. How are you going to repackage these? Uh, you know, are, are you going to put them in, in individual packages? You know, like the, the four by four cellophanes or things like that. So let's say yes, we're going to do something like that. Uh, you know, we're going to put a, a packaging cost on there, and our packaging cost is going to cost us about a dime each. All right. So now, how many of these can we press an hour? This is where you have to do math and you have to be efficient to find out. You know, to figure it out. Now, we know that I could have pressed all nine of those. Uh, in that hour, I could have had them all sprayed out there and did that and, and did there. So, you know, realistically, I can get 10 a minute, right? So that, that wouldn't be unheard of to, to say, hey, you know, if there's 10 a minute that we do 600 an hour, right? Like, well, you know, that's not true because you're you're taping things, you're putting things out, you're putting out there. So 100 an hour? Yeah, I think 100 an hour would be way easy to do on that. All right. So by doing this, that brings our cost that, that our labor and overhead based on what our pricing structure is uh, and what our cost of overhead is, is we have 65 cents in labor on that. Now we have a defect rate of 5%, which is pretty standard across the board because nobody's perfect. You know, things don't always work out. You're going to screw stuff up. So 5% is pretty standard to put on there. So that means we got to account for that, that, you know, those defects. We got to account for those screw ups. We got to account for those happy smiles, those learning experiences. And that cost is six cents. As we come across there, okay, that means our total product cost is $2.30, right? So delivered cost is $2.30, right? Uh, yeah, because we got to put it in here. Oh, retail. So what do we want to retail these at for? Okay, this is where we're going to see what our numbers come out to. Now on Etsy, which is a great place to look at if, if you're trying to gauge where things are, I saw that they were priced anywhere between $8 and $14. All right, so let's just put an eight dollars in here. All right, eight dollars. So uh, if we have it, uh, if we have, what do I want to do here? I want to let me to, to cube this. Oh, freight out. That's what I was missing. Freight out. So if we're shipping these, so if we're shipping these out and you're doing one at a time, and, and it just what is, what's the average going to cost you? You know, four dollars, two ninety nine. You know, you're going to ship the cheapest way possible. Let's just say that you know that it's going to be four dollars, right? Four dollars is going to be your cheapest ship rate. So that means total product cost is two dollars and thirty cents here. When we look across, um, you know, that means to get it delivered, you know, when we ship it to somebody, it's costing us six dollars and thirty cents. So if we retail these at eight dollars, 
our total profit is five dollars and seventy cents, and we have a margin of seventy one twenty. Okay. Now retail, if we're saying retail uh, delivered retail is going to be you know it costs us four dollars here, and we're having the customer pay for that, so we're going to charge twelve dollars. Well. That means our profit is the five seventy. We're still making that, but you got to remember that margin is now way lower at at forty seven because we're not making anything off of off the shipping. We're not making off anything off of that. So you're not making as much profit when you do when when you when you do things that way. So you just got to remember and think about that. Okay. So the great thing about this spreadsheet, when you're a member and you're able to use it, is you can go in here and you can see. Okay, well. Where can I really be at? Well, you know, if my retail is this and my total product cost is $2.30, what if I charge $5? Well, I'm making $2.70. But I'm making 53% margin. You know, that's still not bad. You know, if you're doing 100 of them and you get them done in an hour, I mean, think about that. that that's, yeah, that's $270 an hour, right? So you, maybe you can drop this down even more and you can drop into the you know, a, a $4 range and see where you're at. All right. And see where your numbers are and where you need to be. You know, this is the great thing about this calculator. This allows you to adjust things to see where things need to be, to be able to price things correctly. Cause you want to price for profit. You want to make money on every job you do. There's so many people that say, Hey, you know, all I need to do is I'm paying 92 cents for this. So I just need to double it. If I double it, I'll make that. Well, ninety-two cents—that's a dollar, a dollar uh, eighty, or what is that? A dollar eighty-four would be my wholesale. A dollar eighty-four would be my wholesale. I'm losing forty-six cents on each one. Now, even on that, if I do that times three method, right? Where so many people are like, "Oh, I just need to do this," and it's my my times three, and then I'll be fine. So ninety-two cents times point three, or uh, excuse me, ninety-two, yeah. 0.92 times three is 276. So if we were to do that at $2.76, we are making a whopping 46 cents a piece at 16% margin. Mm, yeah, that sounds like uh, I really want to do that, right? How am I going to invest back in my business? How am I going to put things back in there? I like to keep this margin number no less than 25%, you know, and that's even pushed it. I like to be in the 40 to 50% range, you know, at the very least. Now, where this does work is say I produce these for you and your total cost to you was $2.30. Well, then if you sold them for $2.76, you'd make this without even touching it. That's where I don't mind having a 16% a margin. You know, 10 to 25 when, it, when I'm buying stuff to resell to other people, uh, you know, when I'm using contracted things out, that's where I'm at with it. So in a nutshell, this is your, your pricing. Use this calculator. If you are a member, you have this. Use it religiously so you know where you're at on things. So hopefully that makes sense to everybody and we can uh, we can, we can can kick that out. But hopefully that makes sense on, on how to price things. Use that calculator. If you ever have any questions on it, just email at us. You know that you can email us over at success at our successgroup.com and we will be happy to help. Now, Let's get to the marketing side of things. This is where I think it's always fun that we do. What uh, what are some things that you think that you can do with patches? Because I have a, a couple different ideas, things that uh, events, things that you can do with it. In fact, one of the things uh, we're going to have uh, June. I'm not sure on the date. There, June 16th, I believe, is I'm putting on a, a training in the OSG community uh, for our monthly membership, uh, or people in our monthly membership in our MLS group. Uh, we are going to do fundraising. It's going to be a webinar all on fundraising. That's what the training on. We're going to walk through how I set up fundraising, how it works, things like that. So I can't wait to put that on. But that is a great thing for these. So like this, you know, this is a badge and a shield. Okay, like, uh, let's look at these two. So could you, you know, if, if you're already doing stuff for, say, a fire department, you know, could you talk to your local fire department and be like, hey, especially if it's a volunteer one, right, where they don't have the biggest budgets as it is. They're always trying to, to get things out there. You know, it, it's the fish fry. It's a pancake breakfast. That's the go to for the fire department. But what if they did a little patch thing? And, and you know, looking back at our numbers, let me let me bring our numbers on the screen. 
So we can we can look at that. Then I'm gonna I'm gonna put me on the screen too, so you can see me. Oh, I, no, I want to go, I want to go that way. Yeah. So let's say that we are gonna do a patch order for them, right? They're gonna come up with a fun design on this, you know, fire supporter, you know, whatever. Your fun design. You can put whatever you want on it. And let's look at this cost. So our cost is two dollars. You know, two dollars here. Um, you know, what if we retail them to five dollars, right? So we're making 53%, but then they turn around and they sell it for 10. They buy, you know, say 100 of them. All right, well, you did good, and they made $500. Well, hey, maybe they want to make $5,000. These are the types of things that you can use to make money like this. Because super simple, super easy to do. You saw how quick it was. And they can have it where, you know, they could change it out where maybe this month, you know, we're, what are we in? We're in May. So... Uh, what's something good? Single to mile, you know, if they were going to do something with that, they could put that on there. Graduation, you know, um, you know, ours was the, uh, what did we have? The, the seniors thing where the, you don't drink and drive, you know, on that project graduation, you know, things like that. To, but you can go to, you know, places like that that need it. Right here, Janessa has an amazing idea. I'm going to remove that and put me on here. Because like this, like the idea of making words for athletes. Absolutely. So you can take any one of these, right? Uh, let's pick any size. doesn't matter. You can have it on, you know, okay, here's this, uh, you know, I was first place, you know, all around gymnastics at this one, but boom, here's a patch that's going on my, on my bag. You know, uh, I'm first chair in band, boom, you know, it goes on there accomplishments. So things for like, uh, you know, clubs and groups that where they can personalize and they can do that. You know, they always, you know, not always have the money to be able to do things like that. So if you're able to go to them and say, hey, listen, I can provide this to you at five bucks and we can completely personalize, customize however you want. We have different shapes and sizes for you to choose from. What can we do for you to be able to personalize and make it commemorative for your athletes? Done, right? Get out of here. You know, when they have that that, uh, that senior dinner at the end of the year, that um, the projects, the what, are, what the hell is that called? The award ceremony. You know, they get things like that. And then guess what? They can just put them on at home. So, yes. That is a great idea for making awards for athletes. Great job. Great thinking. Way to go on that for Janessa. The other thing is if you're doing events or shows. Hey, if you're doing an event or a show, could you take that and put that logo on one of these? Can you do something that, that is going to commemorate that event or that show and have that on there? Or there's another idea. When you're doing shows, you know, say you got a... Uh, uh, farmer's market, maybe you do have a farmer's market, right? A farmer's market, or you have a craft fair, you're going something there. If it's themed, if it's something that, or if you've already got a theme in it, hey, why can't you put on that? You know how many kids I see with weird patches on their on their jean jackets and or on their, their bags and, and their travel things? Hey, you know, that's something you can offer. Put funny sayings on it. Do something like that. Uh, something else that you can do is I've seen people do this with their vacation photos or their vacations of where they're going to. They want some there. Then they, you know what they do with them? They put them on their suitcase. So guess what? Now their suitcase has all like, remember the old school luggage tags, or, you know, that the, the, you'd have the stickers all over it of places you've been to. You can do that with patches and put them all over your suitcases that way. So another great thing that you can do. Uh, if there's any, like I said, clubs, organizations, you know, biker clubs, both motorcycle and bicycle those are great ones that are looking for patches, running clubs, any type of club that you can offer something for them that's unique to them in their club. And with sublimation, remember that you can do full color. You can do pictures. You can do anything on that. So sublimation is where you can really shine on that. Uh, because sometimes you just can't get, you know, while embroidery looks amazing and, and embroider patches are well worth everything that somebody wants to charge for them, sometimes they just can't get that fine lettering detail because it does have limitations. That's where this comes in because you're, then you're able to, to do that with more. You're able to get that in there and to be able to put it down for, you know, one or two things, you know. I don't do embroidery patches, but I can only assume to do one embroidery patch sucks. I would just assume that. So, uh, Missy, great. RC Aviation Club. We've got one right down the road here. I should totally go there and hit those up. Uh, is the adhesive on the back strong enough to go on something you can't press, like a band instrument case? 
Okay, I got you on this, Kevin, because no, I don't believe that it's going to be good for that. But what I do believe that it's good for is if you head over to this place called the Rhinestone World, they have this stuff called Bling Anything and HTV Anything that, guess what? It will turn just about anything into a decal. So you would take this and you would heat apply it to this. And then you would cut that, trim that out, and what does it do? Now it becomes a decal. So now what does that open up? That can go on your hard cases. That's what we did here with this leather patch that we got from Renee, was we put it on bling anything, and now it became a, a, a decal for the cup. So yes, we could take this same thing, put it on here, and make a decal for the cup. I guess it's upside down. So Yes, that is what you. That is how I would present that. That yes, you can take this. You can turn it into a decal using the decal anything or the HTV anything or the bling anything, depending on what name it's being called this week and which one it is. But I believe it's just the the bling anything and the HTV anything. And you could turn these into decals. So, guess what? Now where can you put that? Like Kevin said, hey, I can put that right on that band instrument case. I can put that on that substrate that I can't get to that heat from that backside on or that can't go underneath my press. So there is another great option, great alternative for you. Now, uh, agreed on the essays. Can you press two together with a loop and make a keychain or a luggage tag? I would 100% say you probably could. You're going to peel that off there and you're going to press it there. Now, the way that you would have to do that, because there is no connector, like when you do the leather ones where you do the two pieces from here, <laughs> is that once done, I think you just have to press the hole, right? You just have to punch the hole in it, and then now you have that double-sided image that's through there. Because I believe that adhesive, once two together, will stick just fine uh, once we have it the right way. But I would believe so. That's what we got to test and try out. And you know the best people to test and try out with? Yourself, right? Hey, let's see what happens with this. Let's press two of them together. Let's see what happens. All right, perfect. It works out good. I can put it here. I can show it off and put it on there. So... Many different options, uh, especially sizes, shapes, and colors. There are uh, one of the other things that from JDS is not only these, but they also have the faux burlap ones too. So you're just not limited to white. Uh, they do have the faux burlap ones, so you're able to do that. But my friends, that I believe is a wrap until... You know, somebody else gets some more information. You know, tell me what you're thinking. What are some ideas that you have? Uh, we heard, you know, here from Janessa that says, you know, she liked the idea of making awards for ath for athletes. Missy with the Aviation, uh, RC Aviation Club, which, hey, you know what happens at the RC Aviation Club? They go to the same place that has the RC Truck Club, you know, the rock crawlers. They, it's the same ones that have the dragsters. They're the same ones that just have the regular ones. So getting in good with one of those, then you get into that place, and guess what? Boom, everything starts to open up more and more and more. So uh, then Renee with one of the, the chain and luggage tag, great thing there. And Eric is 100 right, probably the HTV anything because it's a tiny bit cheaper. Yeah, and here's the thing. When you get something like that, excuse me, I'm going to take a sip of my water. So when you go and you get something like that, right, we're going to add this here. So here's this, you know, here, here's what I have in here for my patches. Here's, <coughs> excuse me, very number total product cost. When I scroll back over here, when I have, you know, my uh, other cost, right? So other cost. So once I figure out how much HTV anything is going to cost me, so let's say that HTV anything is going to cost me 50 cents to turn that into it. I'm going to cough. Hold on one second. I'm going to try. I'm going to mute me because it's going to be a, it feels like it's a, going to be a crazy one. Oh, I did not want to do that for you. I feel really dried out on that. So you would add that in there. So we know where our cost is. We had the freight in, we had it. Now we added that new cost to it. As we scroll over here, we can see what our total product cost is now. Yep, so okay, now we're at with our pricing. So that'll factor that in there. So we add in add-ons like that, perfect for doing things like that, uh, to, to be able to add those and uh, and take those, and, you know, to upsell a product, turn it into something else, and it's super easy to add to that. Like I said, if you're a member of OSG, that is in your dashboard. 
you should be using that religiously day in, day out. When you get new products in, testing, we're doing it. Run it through there so you can see where it's at. Oh, look, and we made it. So Renee can still make her dinner reservation. Super happy. Here's the service for employees. Absolutely. Uh, so we've seen that a lot with like the Shields where it's done that where, you know, here's a service that'll have the name here that kind of has that ribbon and it'll have like the, the um, sunburst type one, 25 years, five years, 10 years. You can do whatever you want. The other thing, so say you have this fabric like this and you're, you're doing it. We're going to go ahead and we're going to go with Eric and Eric, you know, it's like, Hey, yeah, HTV, anything. Now we turned it into decal. I can put that on a plaque that then I can put another piece on, you know, you can sublimate on the plaque, you can do that. So now it becomes more of a dimensional, dimensional thing. So you can do a lot of things with these. You just got to think outside of it right there. Classic car clubs, same thing. You know, here's any type of club, you know, would love to have a custom patch. You do it now. So say how many here would love to do this, but they don't offer sublimation currently. You don't have a sublimation printer. I know that part sucks. You know, you need a sublimation printer. Well, you don't because, hey, guess what? If you're a member of Club OSG, eh, Club OSG, if you're a member of that, you can utilize Aaron over at Monkodat Biz and he can send you transfers ready to press. So you can be like, okay, I'm setting this up. What's my area that I need? And he'll give you the, the measurements of the paper of what your layout is. So you can do you know, as many that you can fit in there for X amount of dollars. Okay, I've got this project coming on there. Hey, can I do this? How is this going to work? There you go. Just print out the transfers. You'll get sent to you. So then when you would come back over to the price sheet, you'd be able to, here's my transfer cost. Here's what it is for each one. And you'd still be able to make money off of it. So just because you don't have a sublimation printer does not mean that you cannot offer something like this. Now, you don't have a heat press? I got you. Send us a message. We can go ahead and hook you up with stuff like this, pre-done, ready to go. So you don't even have to do that. You just have to sell it. So if our cost to you, you know, if, if we're working on a you know a thirty percent margin here, let's see if let's see where we could get it at. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu, I'm gonna share the screen again. So if we go through here, and and you know we're shipping it out and everything's here because you know maybe our our, our freight costs now that we're doing you know a hundred of them to you. Is going to bring that down to 25 cents, you know, is what it's going to cost in there because everything shipping together, you know, it, we're going to bring it in there. So now my total cost is, you know, $2.80. I'm going to sell them to you. You know, I'm going to see where where uh, my numbers are on it. Uh, well, okay. I, can I get away with like a third on there? So let me see where, where my numbers are. Four fifty. Four fifty dollars probably about the lowest I'd go on it, you know. Four fifty to me, then you could turn around and if the if your same cost is that, throw it through your numbers where it is. Okay, what can I mark that up to and still make money? So you can still get out there and do it. You know, it's just getting it's just getting out there. And this brings up an interesting topic uh, or conversation right here. So I remove this. Uh, a few Facebook user because I don't know who you are, so I can't address you directly. And the way to around that is to just head over to fatdadlive.com or liveosg.com. And then we can actually be able to, to say, hey, so-and-so, this is what we do. So, you know, now I'm using the clients. Well, I mean, that's on you. Like, I mean, just because I give you the tools to build a house doesn't mean that, you know, that the house is just going to get built. You actually have to build the house. So you have to get out there and put in the work. You have to get out there and believe in yourself. You have to get out there and do the work. You know, hit the pavement, get out there, put your information out there, get outside of your comfort zone, you know, network, you know, is there other people in other businesses that you know that are already business owners? Hey, how can you work together? Is there something that you can do? You know, is there a pizza place that, that you use that you can give pizza coupons out with your order, every order you sell and exchange, they'll put, you know, a coupon for a shirt on every order that they send out the door. Start thinking of ways that you can network with other people and do other things because, hey, that type of stuff matters, you know, work small, work with other people, you know, do what you can do to help support other local businesses. Because when you all thrive together, guess what? You're, you're always looking for people, you know, now the pizza guy, not only is this, hey, he needs shirts for his people. Hey, they're running a promo and they want to do something like this. Be the go-to guy. You are an expert in your industry. Nobody does what you do better than you. So present yourself that way. Hey, I'm the expert in DTF printing. But I know 
as much as I do about it, but I know what, you know, do I know everything? No. Do I know more than a good amount of people? Yeah. So, Hey, that's my knowledge. You know, you're going to pay for that knowledge. You're going to pay for that. It's the same way with you. You know, somebody who knows nothing about shirts, it's our job to educate them. Here's why this all made shirt is effing amazing. This is why I love this shirt, right? I mean, there's a reason behind everything. You know, educate your customers. Tell them, hey, this is why this shirt is this way. This is why this shirt this way. This is why this. This is what you're going to pay for this. This is this. This is why. Let them know. The better educated your customers are, the easier it's going to be for them to order. The better it's going to be for them. And the less stress it's going to cause you. So get out there, educate your customers. Go on from there. Oh, Missy, I have one, and I still used Aaron and Kylie for the Flight Museum Mass. I made great money off that order. All I did some art to Monaco. I'm telling you, going forward in the future in my business, if I could make my business 90-10, where 90% of my stuff I sent out and 10% is what I did in-house, I would totally do that. Because like that's time that I was spent before on production, I could do on sales and make more money with less hassle. There's nothing wrong with selling out work. Absolutely nothing wrong with it. I know it's a control issue. I get it. I was there having get rid of, or letting go of that control and putting it in somebody else's hands that you have no clue if it's going to come together. And it's not going to come together every time. Hey, we just talked earlier how I screwed up an order for somebody. Things happen. But when you know people and you can discuss it with them and talk about it, you know who the person is, you know, some people just aren't a good fit for everybody. And that's fine. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. That's why they make so many different places. You know, that's why they, there are so many different carriers of, of different HTV and different rhinestones and, and different flock and different inks and, and different printers and different everything because people have choices. And when you tell me that, you know, there's just a lot of competition in my area and I just can't do it. Well, you know, I've seen plenty of times where there's a McDonald's on one corner and a Wendy's on another corner and, and down the street is another McDonald's. They're all fighting for the same people. They're all doing it. They, they're all being the best they can in that area. So people go there. It's all about convenience. Be the shirt person in your area. Be the tumbler person in your area. Be the laser person. Be the patch person. Pick something and be that person. When you become the go-to person, you're the go-to person. You know, T-shirt Todd got thrown at me. It stuck. I'll do anything I can to help anybody out. That's what we do. And we, you know, most times hit that mark on it. Uh, you know, and people know, well, hey, they do good work. And, and sometimes it, it might be a little more than what they would thought. But I just tell them, hey, you know, this shirt's 35 bucks. And they're like, oh, God. I'm like, okay, so that shirt that you just bought, you know, in the mall was 45 you know. And it just has a little swoosh right here. And it doesn't have your name on it or anything. But that's that's 45, right? So you got to present yourself. Do do what you can do to, to better yourself, better your craft, better your business. All right. On that note, I hope everybody enjoyed this Club OSG After Hours. If you are not an OSG member and you would like to sign up for Club OSG, here is your opportunity to do so. Head now over to OurSuccessGroup.com slash Club OSG. Now, when you get there, because I bet I can do this and I can uh, I can uh, stop that screen share and then I bet I can share another screen. Yep, I can. I can because then I can I can show you a, a tab and I can. Uh, oh, which one is it? Is it this one? Mm, let's see. Uh, I think it's this one. Let's see how good I. Uh, yes. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. So you get over here, because I do believe you can still see that. Uh, no, you can't, because i got to add it to the stream. <laughs> so when you get over here, and you head to OurSuccessGroup.com, you're going to come to slash OSG, or slash Club OSG. You're going to come to our page. So on this page is our is our countdown timer, right? I mean, this is this is where it's at. This is what you got. Uh, this is what you're going to do. Time's run out to save. you got 26 days to, to get it at, the at, at this price. You know, who should get this deal? Anyone who wants to learn how to become successful, uh, who wants to learn how to become successful, learn how to grow their business, or wants live training. Here's what you're going to get. You're going to get your weekly live uh, interactive videos. So you're going to get Small Business Saturday with Aaron. You're going to get 
Tuesday with Todd after hours with me. We're going to do those minimum of twice a month. Small business Saturdays every Saturday. You're going to get proven business strategies. Folks, these are the same things that I use to have grown my business to six figures, and we can do the same to you to grow to six figures. They're going to get proven success principles. Uh, Aaron is a, a certified guy. Screw up the title. But he is a Jan, Jack Canfield certified instructor for um, the success principles. I'm going to get a total better at that. Aaron, I butchered that. I'm super sorry. Uh, but he's a, a leader in the perfect. In, uh, so you're going to get some proven success principles behind that that are going to better yourself and better your business. You're also going to get 10% off over at Fat Dad Wholesale, and you're going to get 10% off Montco.biz. Now, my page has not reloaded yet, but there's going to be three options here. Let me see if I reload it now, if it'll, if it'll come up, because like I said, Aaron was changing this right before we got there. And look, before your eyes, here it is. So you have three options. You can become a monthly member for $14.97. You can become a quarterly member at $39.97, where you're going to save 10%. Or you can just sign up for the year at $149.97, and you're going to save 15% on that. So those are your three options. Now, these prices are good through the end of May. Once June 1st hits, these prices are going up. And then once July 1st, they're going up regular price. So get in now, get in often. Uh, you don't have to get in often. You just need to sign up for once. That's all I need. I mean, but that's what... Uh, Club OSG is that's uh, is that do you see him? Are you seeing that stuff? Did that scroll down there? I didn't even see if no, you guys didn't even see any of that, did you? Where is that Chrome tab at? Oh, I was on the wrong tab. Haha, <laughs> okay. So let me let me roll through that again for you since it was it was totally off there because <laughs> I was on the wrong one. So now I can actually see. I'm actually going to pull this one over here now, so that way I can I can look off screen and see it because I feel like a total dirt bag for doing that to you guys. So times are not to save. You head over to, to oursuccessgroup.com/clubosg. You're going to see here's the countdown camera. There's everything that I said. Who should grab it? Anyone who wants to learn how to grow their business and wants live training. Here's what they're going to get: the weekly live interactives, proven business strategies, proven success principles, 10% off Fat Dad Wholesale, uh, 10% off Montco.biz. Here's your three options to become a member monthly, quarterly, or yearly. Come remember day, you just got to click on one of those. If you've currently already signed up for the monthly because the other ones weren't in there, all you need to do is just head over here and send us an email at, where is it at? At success at oursuccessgroup.com. And we'll go ahead and get that adjusted to you to a quarterly or yearly member. With that, do we have any questions, comments, and concerns? If not, we're going to call it a night. Oh, when are we going to have Club OSG training on an OSG island? OSG island, Bonefish K had been sold. It was sold for $7 million. Uh, that was on my list to buy. It was already set, ready to go. Well, we could have had a sweet, sweet setup there, but <sighs> it's sold. So when an island comes again of that caliber, hey, we're just going to, we're just going to put it up there and, and go from there. Just signed up for the Facebook page is not opening. Yeah, it's because it's got to give you access to it. I'll make sure that it does. Chuck, I'll look into that for you. Uh, but that's the other thing, too. Uh, you will have a, a private Facebook members group just for Club OSG. Uh, regular members, you will have access to that as well if you would like to go in there, visit, say hello, and do anything like that. All right. Uh, once again, head over to... We got it right here, our success group.com slash club OSG to learn more about this. You guys have an amazing night. Happy Star Wars Day. May the fourth be with you. Tomorrow is Cinco de Mayo. Have one on me uh, because, hey, we're, we're going to, we're probably going to have tacos or something. We'll do that. You guys have a great night. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for taking time out of your day to, to spend with me. I'm so blessed and, and honored that you are have done that. I couldn't ask for a better group of folks to be around. Let's get successful and let's start going. See you guys.